So let's jump in and chat about these shoes. First impression, I love them. How can you not love these? They're beautiful. I'm so, so happy with my purchase. I'm really a gold girl, like 100%. But I'm so happy that I like took a step out and like departed from my normal and got this metallic silver color, which I feel like on camera is not even really giving silver. But that's what I love about it, that it kind of reflects whatever you're putting it next to. So I just really think it's going to be a great addition. It's going to go with so much that I have and it's going to be like, you know, that little pop that you need sometimes mm -hmm. to jazz it up and put it with like a real patterned got a lot going on outfit but it also can be like your statement on an all black moment um and speaking of black they also come in black but i thought this would be cooler so super super happy with how they look but that being said the fit has things to be desired we'll say so i typically am a perfect size eight i never need to change at all i don't go down i don't go up it's an eight but these i decided to go up to an eight and a half because in the past when i've tried on luxury shoes i almost always have to size up i'm sure that some of you have had experiences that were similar to that um so i got a 38.5 which is an eight and a half and honestly i could have did a 39 i could have done a full size up because I, there's no room to spare it's foot to foot like it's yeah no room to spare um and on top of that this front strap here if you can see is pretty narrow i don't have narrow feet at all um i don't have wide feet at all it's just a normal sized foot but this is really tight i've even stretched it out some from like the original clips that i've shown through to now it's probably like a couple of little millimeters wider and that's because when i'm not wearing the shoes i'll keep it overstuffed um with tissue paper just to try to stretch that out and make it more comfortable um because as you walk it's a mule there's nothing like holding your ankle up so all of the force of your foot is going down and getting like pressed into here so doesn't sound comfortable is not comfortable um stretching it is like definitely the way these are probably about four to five inch heels um i'm gonna say yeah four and a half to five inch heels um and like very little platform these are not your oh i'm gonna be going to a wedding and out on town and dance if you wear these to a wedding you better carry some flats in your purse or these in my mind are a dinner shoe we wear our flats to the car we put these on before we get out the car valet tiptoe to the table we are not running around being on our feet all night in these shoes cute moments only um so definitely keep that in mind because it is a larger purchase thankfully i was able to get these on sale i got them from farfetch um before the holidays it was like severely marked i got them for 233 they're typically almost like a 700 dollars shoe so definitely recommend farfetch for like if you're in the market for a new luxury purchase, they do have good promotions from time to time. I do know that like the last time that I looked, um, the sale had gone away like almost right after I received my shoes. But keep an eye out if you're in the market um, and you do want to save a couple of coins. Nobody's ever mad at that. All that being said, I, even though I still haven't worn them out yet because we're still getting to know each other. I try it on around the house and see if my stretching's going well, but I love, 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 love them. Would buy again. They will be making their debut soon. I hope you guys enjoyed and you found this informative. Uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. Comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. If you're interested in outtakes, stay tuned. Stuffing it with Yes, Logan. You can come in. Okay. Hey, Logan. Mommy's making a video. Why? Because I want to show off my shoes.